Structure of neuron. To learn about various parts of the neuron and their respective function. In human beings, brain is the center of the nervous system. A magnified view of the brain shows a network of neurons. The neurons play a vital role in the transmission of nerve impulses. The other type of cell present is the neuroglial cell, which helps in providing support to the neuron. Let us now study the structure of a neuron. It has three parts, an axon, a cell body, and dendrites. Dendrites are the short, branched cellular extensions of the cell body. They connect the neuron to the other surrounding neurons and receive signals in the form of impulses. The cell body, also called the cyton, is the central part of the neuron. A magnified internal view of the cell body shows a nucleus and cytoplasm containing mitochondria and endoplasmic reticulum. The endoplasmic reticulum shows nissel bodies, which are seen scattered on its surface. The nissel bodies are a characteristic feature of neurons. Another characteristic feature of nerve cells are the neurofibrils, which are delicate thread-like structures that help maintain the shape of the cell. The part of cell body, or cyton, from where the axon emerges is a cone-shaped structure known as an axon hillock. At the axon hillock, impulses received by the dendrites are accumulated and then transmitted through the axon. The axon is long and helps to transmit neural signals along its length. It is covered intermittently by a fatty substance called the myelin sheath. On the axon, we observe a Schwann cell wrapped around it. The Schwann cells begin to secrete layers of fatty deposits known as myelin. There are gaps with no myelin sheath, and these gaps are known as the nodes of Ronvier. The terminal boutons are located at the end of the axon branches and are responsible for sending the signal to the other neurons. The junction between the axon terminal of one neuron and the cyton of the other neuron is known as the synapse. Let us focus on the unidirectional movement of impulse through the neuron. A zoomed out view shows that the impulse always travels from the cyton to the axon and then is passed on to the next neuron. A summary will help us remember that a neuron has three main parts, namely the dendrites, cyton, and axon. The axon shows a covering known as the myelin sheath, which helps in impulse transmission. The impulse travels through the neuron in one direction only, that is from cyton to the axon.